Good morning children, I really hope you had a lovely weekend. It's going to be a really beautiful warm day today. We're going to have a bit of a different assembly this morning and our theme is on British values. So we gather here today as one St Thomas small family and we're going to start by making the sign of the cross. Our candles are already lit as a sign that God is here among us. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Now, during this assembly, I'm going to be asking you lots of questions. So your teachers might want to pause when I ask the questions so you can have a little bit of thinking time. We're going to play a game of put your hand up if. Are you ready? Put your hand up if you have brown hair. You wear glasses. You have a brother or sister. You like football. You can speak another language. You like swimming in the sea. You were born in this country. You know what you want to be when you're older. All these things help to make up who you are. They help to make up your identity. So what else makes up your personal identity? Groups or clubs that you belong to, maybe scouts, rugby, dancing. What your interests or talents are, maybe you love watching films. Perhaps you love to sing. What things are important to you? Those things really help to make up who you are. Your hopes for the future. Which people are important to you? Your family, perhaps friends, perhaps neighbours. Your religion. The languages that you speak. And the country that you are from. What you value also makes up part of who you are. We're going to play another game and this is where I really need you to think carefully. And there shouldn't be any sound in the classrooms when you do this. It's going to be a thumbs up or a thumbs down. I'm going to show you some words on the board and if you think that that thing is important to you, if it is something that you value, then you give me a thumbs up. And if not, it's a thumbs down. Honesty. Hard work, caring, resilience, laziness, kindness, fun, rudeness, hurtful, and love. Our school halls are really important to us and they help make us who we are in St Thomas More. To follow instructions straight away, to keep hands free from public to yourself and to use positive language. We also have our bubble walls as well and they help us to become the family that we really need to be. We have talked a lot about personal values and about our school values, but can a country have values? We all live in Britain. What do you think the British values are? We are so lucky that we live here because our values are incredible. Let's have a look at them. Democracy, the rule of law, individual liberty, mutual respect, tolerance of those of different faiths and beliefs. We're going to look at each of these in turn now. When I ask the question, your teachers can pause so that you can have a little bit of thinking time. Democracy. Britain is a democracy. This means that the people in Britain vote for the people who make the laws and decide how the country is run. If we didn't have a democracy, just one person might be able to make all the laws and that would not be fair. Think now, in what ways do we show the value of democracy in school? The rule of law. In Britain, we have a police force who make sure people do not do the wrong thing and break the law. This means that we are safe. In what ways do we show the value of the rule of law in our school? Individual liberty. In Britain, as long as we do not break the law, we can live as we choose to and have our own opinion about things. You can pause there and just think about how we have individual liberty in our school. Mutual respect. We might not always agree with other people, but we try to show respect for their thoughts and feelings. 
We can give respect to others and we can expect others to show us respect. In what ways do we show the value of mutual respect in our school? Tolerance of those with different faiths and beliefs. In Britain, we accept that other people might have different beliefs than ours and they may believe in different religions. In what ways do we show the value of tolerance and those of different faiths and beliefs in our school? Let's look at that list again. Democracy, the rule of law, individual liberty, mutual respect, tolerance of those of different faiths and beliefs. Take a moment, children, to think about how lucky we are to live in Britain, a country with such strong values. We get ready to listen. This is very short, children, so I really want you to listen to these words. I'm going to say it a couple of times. Honour your father and mother. Love your neighbour as yourself. I'm going to say it one more time. Just think about these words. Honour your father and mother. Love your neighbour as yourself. The Gospel of the Lord. We respond. Jesus wants us to treat others how we would like to be treated. Can you imagine how our school would look and feel if everybody did this? Can you imagine if the whole world did the same? Now, children, you're not allowed to sing, but I can sing because there's nobody else here. But you can join in with the, uh, with the signing. So the response is, Father, Father. Help me to live out the values that I believe in. Help me to live out the values of St. Thomas More. Father, 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 hear our prayer. Dear Lord, help me to remember that your Son, Jesus Christ, wants us to treat everyone in the way that we would like to be treated. Help us to put Christ at the centre of everything that we do. Father, 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 hear our prayer. This week you're going to receive a little passport and you can do this in PSHE or maybe after the assembly and you're going to think a little bit more about the values that you hold, a little bit more about your identity, those things that make you different but also that connect you with other people. And you're going to create your own little passport, so I can't wait to see those. And I'm really looking forward, children, to having another really positive week. Just a reminder of our house point, remember to be resilient, so keep going even if it's really hard, and put loads of effort into your work so that we can collect house points, because these are going to be counted this Friday. And we go, and our mission is to live out the British values so that we can treat others in the way that we would like to be treated. And we make the sign of the cross in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.